uh, what you see on the, the fly ball uh, to left or left center? Yeah, I saw a uh, a ball that was probably more in, in left field than uh, than in center field. Recording um, in progress. Obviously, you know what you teach all of, what we teach all of our you know outfielders and especially our younger players is to you know uh, unless you hear something, go after the ball hard and and you know Selly did that in center field. Um, I think that's probably a, a you know from our angle, it's not necessarily the easiest. You know, we don't like to get the TV view, but it kind of looked like a ball that Larnick was was under and, and ready to make the play on. Um, and and Selly, you know, went over and, and continued to call the ball. And uh, obviously, uh, we didn't make the play. So I think that's, um, well, I mean, it's it's a routine fly ball and that, you know, we, we certainly have to catch uh, uh, and make the play on. And, it, you know, it, it's certainly tough to, to go down and, and give up a run in a game where, you know, not that it came easy, but our guys were grinding this out and we kept coming back and making things happen and got ourselves back in the ball game a couple of times. Um, and to, to, you know, lose like that is, is tough, but there's no time to dwell on that. Um, we have to find a way to, uh, you know, get ourselves up and, and get going again. Um, on a play like this, besides kind of a continued conversation about uh, communication, like how does something like this get addressed either, you know, by you or, or by Tommy or whoever else may do it? Yeah, I, Betsy, I mean, this is um, this is a play that both of those guys have seen many, many times in their career. This is not an unusual play. Um, this is a routine fly ball to, to I would say, the left fielder. Um, based on where those guys are playing when the balls hit and it's it's just a play it's not it's not a play that anyone anyone in baseball would look up and say that's that's you know difficult in any way i think the potentially the crowd um you know the size of the outfield here uh and and the desire to not let the ball drop you know uh maybe not taking Sally also not maybe wanting to take his eye off the ball to glance up these are things that do come with with experience and comfort, and I think that um, you know, being two young guys out there in a in a you know major league uh, uh, situation and and finding themselves on that play is really what you can point to, maybe more than anything else. But um, it's it's a learning opportunity. I think this is a this is something that um, both guys will take something out of. Uh, and and not let something like that happen again. I mean, uh, a lot of it, it it's not necessarily uh, that big of a teaching moment. It's not as though there's a lot to go over and, and talk about. I do think that, though, with um, being able to go play the game in, in a relaxed way like you do your entire life um, and taking it out there when the, when the big league game starts is, is really what this is all about. Rocco, um, obviously it took you just a little bit longer than usual to get to this press conference. Was there any discussion in the locker room or any kind of conversation to the meeting um, after this loss? No, I mean, it, this was this was a tough um, night, the way that it all played out, because, you know, we did some things well. We had some guys have some good days at the plate. Um, and, and obviously... Uh, you know, we're not getting the outcomes that we want. And we didn't again tonight. I'll tell you the delay, Megan, uh, was just me being in the coaches room, talking to our coaches about a few things that happened in, in the game. Um, and I thought it was, a. there are times when that's the first place I go when, when the game ends. And, uh, this was one of those nights, this was one of those nights for us to, you know, spend a little time chatting about some things and, um, you know, acknowledging what's what's going on out there uh, during the game. And, you know, we don't do that every night after the game because, you know, everyone's making their way out sometimes, but sometimes we do. And this was one of those times.